V12R just purchased. This is the Firebolt. Some scratches on the fairing. Forks leaking terribly. It's all over the brakes. Yeah, it has some scratches on both sides. This is intended to be the before video. But it's not a really bad looking bike. Well, that's my KLR behind it. Not a bad bike. Something I don't get is these mirrors. They get in the way of the of the hand grips. See if you're so over here. Turn that wheel. Turn. See, here we go. You turn the handlebars, and your hand hits the the mirror right there. So that's not right. There's damage right here to this bracket, and I've already ordered a replacement. There's damage to this. Um, fuse box over here. This actually it's a relay box. Um, what else is there to show? Looks like when they put this back together they didn't put the spring back in the uh, foot peg. A little bit bent here. Looks like both forks are going to need some attention. <clears throat> They say that it was uh, blowing fuses too. That's probably just a couple of bare wires touching each other. I wonder if this. Yeah, that one has the uh, that one has the spring. This one doesn't. Yeah, looks like we're gonna need some springs. Another thing we're gonna need right here. This the bolts are missing that hold on the seat. So you have to be sitting on it, or else the seat's going to fly away. And we need a battery. They intend to empty the tank. Let's take a look at the tank. There we go. There we go. Yeah. Well, it has gas in it. I'll have to drain that. So that gas has been there for five years. Make some good solvent for cleaning other motorcycles. So there you have it. 2004 Buell XB12R Firebolt.